My sars, sars. Yeah. Do you, by any chance, have any money uh, that you could spare? I have a court case to get custody uh, I'm, I'm, of my I'm children. Just, listen, I'm just gonna say, look what the hell we're driving. You think we got money? I, well, I do. Look what the look. hell I'm driving. You're in luck, because I'm after four and a half thousand dollars. Have you got it? No, I, I don't. I, I got no money. I got no pants. I'm about to lose custody of my two baby boys. Are you, are you uh, homeless? I, no, I live up in Sandy. I had to run all the way down here. Honestly, your kids going into the system is probably much better than living in Sandy Shores. No, my two yeah. baby boys. Uh, 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 I mean, how much do you need? I need like literally twenty dollars to just go get some paints and look a little bit more professional for the judges. I mean, you could nearly pull this off as you wearing a skirt, you know. I, I think I do have a skirt on underneath this. It just ain't long enough. I couldn't afford more fabric. Yeah, Jesus how, Christ! How about this? We go to the court right now. Uh -huh. Oh God, here we go. And we my, can, we my, can. My court case is in half an hour. Uh. I don't don't tell the lawyer I ain't got no money. Oh, twenty. Oh, you got twenty dollars. I ain't giving a sandy crackhead no money. I she's ain't a, a crackhead. She's not a crackhead. Yeah, she's my, just my, a husband, crackhead. my nice. husband. My husband's a police officer. He's been working so hard to provide for our twin Wait, boys. Your husband, your Wait, husband, who's your who? Oh, what's your husband's Jesus. name? A uh, Cliff. Cliff. Yeah, Cliff Leesman. He's one of the best police officers on the force. All right, if I give you go $20... Him for money. Okay, yeah, this, is, this is the deal. If I give you $20... Yes? I I need a favor in return. Okay, what what is the favor? I need you to get him... to get me into a helicopter. I need a helicopter to go up north to, 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 to Mount Chiliad, or whatever it's called, so I can get a picture of the said Sa Sasquatch. You you need a helicopter to go up uh -huh. north yep. to get a get picture it. of. Are you calling me a Sasquatch, sir? I know I have luscious hair, but no, no, no. I mean, you're far too small to be a Sasquatch, but well, I, I but... do think I have luxur luxurious curves on my body, but this is not a very flattering I, I'm sorry. outfit. I'm maybe sorry. I should you go are get. A maybe I should go. I'm yes. not looking at you in that Look, way. It's a, okay. Uh, I am I... not patched, to be honest. I'll get, you need to give me your word that you're going to ask Officer Cliff mm -hmm. for said helicopter for me. I, I will Eamon Murphy, M for short. Okay, I will absolutely ask Sweat. My, my husband uh -huh. for a said helicopter for, uh, I just remembered the M for short, I'm being honest. Eamon Murphy. A, a, sure, M and Murphy. Eamon Murphy. Yep, M M M M Murphy. Eamon Eamon Murphy. M for short. M N. Yeah, you just dropped the second letter there. Oh my God! Just say M for short. Holy shit! And what's your own name? Oh, my name's Pauline. 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 Yep, Pauline Leesman. I got a shortened version because that's my son's name, Paul. 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 Pauline. Fantastic. Yep. All right. I don't think it sounds real. Let's go. My sons are absolutely t real. I got, I got. That's that's a dollar. I ain't gonna. I can buy like a centimeter. What? You, how much do you need again? I, you Since gave me a dollar. I need twenty dollars so I can go buy Just a better pay outfit. You'll probably go blow it and crack. It's fine. Just give it a twenty. No, my, I have, I have twin baby boys. Yeah, you Saul crack pipe Saul, with your bong. Nice. Saul, no, Saul and Paul. There, there they, you they, go. They, they, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna go right. look more professional. So, wait, wait. For the court where case. will I see you after this? Because I'm going to. Well, I, I'm going to the courthouse it? once I figure out where that is. Well, first I'm going to the clothing store because I know where that is, and then I'm going to go to the courthouse. To... We say one hour from now you'll be here. Well, I don't know how long this court case is going to uh, take. All right, an hour. To, an okay, hour. An okay. Hour. When's, the, when's the court case? It's in a half an hour. What's at the top of the hour? Okay. All right. We'll, I'll, I'll, we'll see you in court. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we'll be at court. So, uh, yeah, that doesn't look really, uh, mannerly for a court, eh? I, 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 I thought this is perfect for a court. I show up that what makes me a mother. That, yeah, I can show yeah. what makes you a mother. 
Are you looking for any more kids? That's definitely. <laughs> yeah. And then I, 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 I am. Oh, I will. I, I, I decided against the hat. And a pencil skirt is a, a makes me me smart, and, and and I put on my smart my smart well, glasses. Why are you and, children, it sounds like you're uh, you're making all of this up in the spot. I I, I I I put a lot of effort into this outfit. Yeah, they're most certainly not going to give you your kids back in that. Yeah, you uh, probably could put effort more into like your kids' lives. Well, no, no, I, 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 I put a lot of effort the into with this court case. No, I absolutely have. A, you can go to the here. Look, I will, I will, take me to the police station, I will tell you. But do you think I should put on a different shirt? Is it not showing off? It's, it's showing off, all right. Is it, is it? Showing is it, off what makes you a mama? But, I'm all for it, to be honest. Yeah, Look, this is, day. yeah. This is what I wear at home when I'm with my kids. Yeah, just, just get in the oh. trunk. Just, just. Did you bundle it into a trunk? Yep. Uh, probably not a first time to be honest. <laughs> My husband's anyway. probably waiting for me at the police station. Yeah. Oh, this sure. is gonna look real bad if he's actually a cop. <laughs> Why did we pull his wife out the trunk? <laughs> no, I don't know. I'll yeah, let you do to... the talking. New York can do the goddamn talking. Uh, I want to get this all squared out. I want to get to the bottom of this. See if she's actually it's only twenty the truth. bucks. <laughs> that's a lot of money for me at the minute. They're, they're trying to buy my children for $80 each. Oh my god. <laughs> Who's buying what? I think she's selling her kids for 80 bucks a piece. No, it's not. It was It was a joke that is apparently a verbal contract. She sold her kids for 80 bucks a piece? Holy shit. Well, one is a little bit smaller than the other. Hey, so he's probably worth about 65. So well, that's what no, he ain't worth. He's just, he's just a slow grower. What? What's slow she saying? I have no idea. She's just mumbling for me. Got like a <laughs> slug growing somewhere. What? Maybe. No, he's just a slow grower. Wait, so like, it, what? what, what is so is yourself that? and your husband still together? But I love my husband dearly. Did you she, understand she, a word she's she, saying? She, she said, so, I think her husband passed away sharply. Wait, your Wait, husband, my husband is dead! Gonna be at the police station. Your my husband's husband is dead. dead. You hear that? Hey, you where, 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 where is my station? husband? What? Where is your husband? Well, you said my husband is dead! Is your husband uh, dead? What the fuck? What? I'm... I haven't seen him in a bit, but he's been working! Okay, what? <laughs> what's, what's your name again? My name is Pauline! Pauline, alright. Pauline! Tony, do me a favor, just go inside. You want me to go ask for Pauline? Wait, wait! Where is my husband? Did you kill him? Just go inside and see if she's if she's making sense. If not, she's Let me out of the trunk! No. Let me out of the trunk! Let me out! Let me out of the trunk! We're gonna get this figured out. Let me out! Sir, is this, it's my is husband, then! Uh, is, is this your... Is this your... What? Get out of the... Get let me out of the trunk! Hey, uh, Open the goddamn trunk! Oh, God. <laughs> she keeps closing oh, herself in! Get out uh, of here! Ma'am. Oh, thank Jesus. God. Okay. All right. No! <laughs> oh, fuck. Explain to me what is going on. Which one is your husband? Where, where is my husband? Are you... Are you... Oh, yeah, are you... The courthouse. What? Uh, is that the courthouse? You said to come to the police department. So he, 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 he was supposed to be here. The about the court case? <laughs> yes. What's it uh. about? Is it about her two kids? What, you think that she's dressed appropriately for the court case? No. See that she's trying to get her two kids <laughs> back? Uh, I'm showing up I'm, what makes me a mother. The, Jesus Christ. I'm, I'm all for it, to be honest. It's big votes in my books, but I ain't the judge. <laughs> um... All right, Pauline, um, get back in the trunk. We're taking you for clothes. Come on. Oh, uh, back oh, in, oh, back in, oh, back oh, in the oh, trunk. Oh, 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 okay. Back, I'll look back, in the back other in the way. Trunk. Yeah, back in the trunk, Pauline. <laughs> That's it. Why aren't we taking it to the courthouse? <laughs> no, because she has to chain. Hell, Where is my husband? <laughs> oh, Your husband's at the courthouse. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I say we just dump her in this head the road. Oh, so, sorry. sorry. She's clearly goddamn delusional. 
I don't, I don't fucking know what's going on. She, she said that her husband and... and I will do her. anything for not to get the clue to get in the stranger's trunk. Anything? Said something about she's, she's <laughs> looking for children. They could be in a stranger's hey, hey, trunk. Hey, Tony, she, that she makes totally a lot of wants sense, to try and find this William White guy. Uh, yeah, wait, she might know. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. It's getting... Make sure no one sees you. Wait. Wait. Oh, God. Wait. This is going to go so wrong. Probably. <laughs> Wait. Hold up. What is going on? No, nothing, Pauline. Just relax. <laughs> just, Wait. Just, if we ain't getting in there, even. there we go. That's good enough. That's good enough. Pop the trunk. Let it get changed, I guess. Right, <laughs> go get changed. Oh, we're oh my God, the coffers. It's all right, Pauline. I... It's all right. Your kids are totally fine. Totally. <laughs> And I left them with the dog. What? The uh, kids locked up a dog. I don't know. I left the kids with the dog. She left, the, left kids the kids with on the dog. dog? The dog. The dog? The dog. Did she say dog? Yeah. She, she left her kids with a dog. All right, we're here. Jesus Christ. Mm-mm. Yeah, sure, your kids are fine. There. <sighs> oh my god, I've just oh fucking hell. Oh my god. I thought she was wearing a jacket with the top. Oh no. <laughs> what? what what is she wearing? She's just, she's just wearing a jacket now, I've just realized. Oh uh, um, Ah uh, fuck it, send her in. Alright, there, there you go. I, I, I go didn't have enough unfold. money. I used it all on the, the other shirt. Hello there. No, this woman uh, is loaded. Uh, so I'm sure she'll pay you right after the court case. <laughs> oh, what? No, I'm looking for uh, Cliff. Has anyone seen Cliff? My husband, where is he? I, I'm, that's what I want to know. <laughs> I was told he was here. <laughs> yeah, we got told he was here. Oh, he's already arrived. Someone told you that? He's meant to the, police, the, the police officers did. We gotta get this woman's, I don't know, crack addiction sorted or something. I, I, I am I, not addicted to crack. Keep telling yourself I'm that, I'm sweetheart. Might stick. Pauline, am I representing you as well, or are you on the other side? Against what? Me? No. I'm with Wait, my husband. Your husband? I love him. No, I love my husband dearly and my two children. That's, okay. My babies. That works. That works then, okay? I can work Wait, with one of you. is this a custody battle, Eamon? I don't even fucking know what's going on. It's a custody battle, but not between the husband and wife. Oh, Wait, somebody else it's is a... trying to take our children. Wait, who's trying to take our children? I, I don't exactly. know. Some... Probably don't the worry. dealers. What? Probably the meth dealers. Don't worry. No one, tell... <laughs> no one tell them when we get inside. I need that natural shock. <laughs> I'm so sure confused. That's right. Where's the security? Use. Pauline, Where? if you need anything, just let me know. Oh, I'm your okay. representative today. Oh, okay. Who are I you? I shall win you this court game. <laughs> My name is Candy Laguna. Feel like I know you. <laughs> I think you were paralegal in my what? first ever arrest, to be honest. Mm. Well, G Candy, I need my husband. Your Honor! Oh my yes? God. Oh my God. This, shit down. <laughs> this is going to be fantastic. <laughs> it's better than fucking the porn I watch at the motel. <laughs> Russell, your pussy's out. Oh, man. Uh, oh, God. Of the I had to take a seat. Uh-oh. Ah, I wanted to have a little bit. Hey, Pauline. Looking good. Oh, my God, Pauline. And watch when I get up, Kit. <sighs> oh. That's a dad noise, right? That's a great dad noise. Wait, wait. Uh, it's just going to be absolutely fantastic. Yeah, it's just like you have to strain everything. <laughs> it's just really are straining <laughs> to be a dad. And my friends are with him. Uh, Candy, we'll where, 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 is my, where is my husband? I don't know. I don't know. I faxed him. I'm hoping he shows. <sighs> this, this is not... I've been told he's been working. He's on the ship today. I don't know. He ain't been at home. I've been at Thanks, home with man. the babies. Oh, shit. Right. Uh, uh, I got the babies see with that the dogs to noises. come here. All right, don't worry about it. I'm sure he'll show. He'll show. Well, where is he? I've gone through three outfits. I don't, 
I don't know. I'm, okay, let me see if I can speak to one of the police officers who might have access to the MDT. I don't know what that is. Is that like an ST? He's been seeing other people got an ST day? No, it's not an ST day. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Just stay here, Pauline. Oh have my a God. drink. Just, uh, something okay. 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 Who is it? Point him out to me. You see, I, I don't know. I, I, I still think Polly could have gotten the better top. What, you know, I guess what it is, I guess. Apparently, she blew all the money on the red top, so it's probably <coughs> drinking. Wait. Is that a bottle of booze? What the? Oh, is that what she spent the 20 bucks on? <laughs> Wait, put it away. What? What? Polly? What? Put it away. I, I need. I need. Okay. Just fucking get it down here, yeah. quick, okay, before anyone okay, sees. Okay, okay. Get, get over there in the corner. Get, 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 get over there. What? 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 Not me. Oh, God. Ma'am. Ma no. Ma'am, I will put you on cuffs. You better get over here right now. Oh, Ooh, and a shirt of woman. Now we're talking. Ma'am, laying down. Ma'am. <laughs> yeah, five seconds what? to get over here before I put you on cuffs. I don't know Ma who you're talking to. I don't see anything at all. Oh. Pauline, it might be time to dash. I swear to God, if you run away, ma'am. Oh. Pauline, just stay still. My patient's best on move, but just stay still. Yeah, nothing to see here, officer. Just, wait, 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 where's it go? I know, right? <laughs> just, I, I think she ran out the door. Okay, well, if you think you're going to tell her to... I would, of course, I would, of course. Drinking alcohol on here. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, before. If you need to put someone in cuffs, ma'am, I'm all, I'm all for it. No, thank you. I don't want to put someone in cuffs. Right? Okay. Damn, I, I shot my shot and it failed. If my husband doesn't show up, I need you to be my husband. <laughs> yes, even be your husband. This is fantastic. This is fantastic. You want me this to be make, your this make great news? Oh, I need oh, you to be my husband. My okay, husband's okay. name is Cliff. He is a police officer. My name is Cliff. And I'm, okay. Okay. That's... Okay. Okay. Please, yep. I, I don't know where he is. He is late. Please be my husband. I will, I will, I will. Okay, come here. No, you might actually be in here, Eamon. I'm proud of you. Please, please oh. come here. I'm coming. Come. Look, my my husband is here. Here's Cliff. Okay. Here. Good to he's see right, you, Cliff. He's, yep, hey. he's right here. Hey, good, good to see you. Great to have you here, Cliff. Yeah, sorry, I'm late. <laughs> That's all good. That's all good. Great to see you. You look hey, different since the last show, so I can work with that. That's fine. Oh, how are you doing? Who is it, this? Bleh, this is my husband, oh, Cliff. I love him dearly. <laughs> I love you too, Polly. It's all good. Everything's gonna be fine. Yep, yep. We have two twin babies. You remember them? Paul and yep. Saul. Paul and Saul. There Paul, you go. Yep. Paul, Paul and Saul. Is, Paul is smaller. They both ride because, Paul you know, it'd be easy. Paul. Easy for each other to remember each other's names when they're young, yep, you know? my name is Pauline. I named Paul after myself. There you go. Paul, yep. Paul, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pauline, Saul. Yep, Paul, Paul and mm -hmm. Saul. Yep. Who is he? I'm pa pa Pauline. Who's that Who man? Is that man? Uh, this is my husband. How do you not remember him? You work with him every day. This is Cliff, my husband. Hi, guys. I'm Cliff. What is this? Sustained. Oh, you're Pauline? saying you're Cliff Leesman? Yeah, I changed my hair. What the fuck is that? Head That's cut? Cliff, is he not? Um, looks like Cliff to me. All right, sir. It's been okay. a long few days. All right, sir. Oh, no, okay, we got it. Uh, it's been like fascinating. Yeah, baby. Holy, holy, move with that type of haircut. Oh, oh, okay. I just I just love my husband. I have not seen him in a while. You could just start saying, fuck it. Just start saying. <laughs> Joe, does Joe know? This is for the children. Oh, sorry, Max. I'm so sorry. For Paul, Paul and Saul, indeed. No, you're Cliff. But Saul is our child. Candy, you got this. You got this. It's be fine, Polly. I don't want it. I haven't sweated since last Tuesday when, when, when I had start? that bull whack. Um, it started ten you minutes ago. Eight, by the way. Oh. I appreciate it, Max. Um, Watch as I fuck them. Max, this, by the way, you know they brought out the backside of your the building? Babies. What's a lawyer's name? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know. Okay, great. So, um, yeah. I think his name is like Candy. Living no shadow. Candy. That's, candy. Not, that's not Candy. I've never met him before. My oh, yeah, my yeah. Sorry. I think my Wait, husband just... got got him. I got it. So.
<laughs> what, what time does this kick off, Kenny? I mean, meant, meant to 10 minutes ago. So I think it's, here we go. Oh. Oh, God. All right. So are the party is ready to proceed, or do you still need more time to prepare? Ready to proceed, Your Honor. Ready to proceed, Your Honor. That's what I'm saying. That, I already Re said ready, it too. ready to proceed, Your Honor. Re ready, ready to proceed, ready proceed Your Honor. Ready to proceed, ready Your Honor. To proceed. Ready, ready. I'm ready. I think, I think, I think you salute him. He, he is ready an ready honor. To proceed there, Paul. Oh. Gotta say it, Paul. That's you. That's, well, yeah, who's Paul? I'm real ready right now. Yeah. Oh I'm yeah, ready. that's Paul. Proceed. Paul, I thought I'm my ready. son was here. I've I thought my son in. was here. I got nervous. Only black say you're on that, Paul. Considering this is a custody hearing, the court will excuse the fact that Councillor O'Leary and Councillor Evans are not wearing proper court attire. Uh, it's we're we're private attorneys. We're going yeah, private. That, doesn't mean, that still doesn't mean that you kids. can show up to my courtroom without wearing proper courtroom attire. But again, oh, I've seen turtle a... oh, well, I, I've, I've seen people in turtlenecks and chains. We okay, haven't so been we'll, we'll allow turtlenecks. The chain, that, that's a little bit tacky. Sure. That's, that's, that's what I thought. That. Okay, that's what about Hawaiian mean? shirt? I'm right here. Hawaiian shirts? No, no, okay. that's not courtroom attire. But Understood. turtlenecks, I'll allow turtlenecks. I like okay. turtlenecks. Me too. They keep your neck warm. I bet, I bet our baby will be a uh, a lawyer one okay. day. Right. Noted. So, Going forward, this will not be our courtroom maybe, attire. Maybe. All right. <laughs> How, how do we look like, Your Honor? Do we look like a fine couple? But we, we put a lot of... We the fuck is that? This is my that? husband. He says he's Cliff Lee's... Objection. Okay, order. Order in the court. We're going to call the trial of Spade v. Leesman's to order. <laughs> Counsel, please enter your appearances. <laughs> What's my surname? Which order? Leesman. You're Cliff Leisman. Leisman. Gotcha. Cliff Leisman. All right. Oh, Hello. No, you. No, it's okay. Um, uh, Kit O'Leary, Chief of Public Defense. Uh, Paul Evans, Deputy Chief of Public Defense. I'm Zane Spade, man. I'm uh, 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 a no, Zane, future dad. Zane, Zane you're not an oh. attorney. We don't oh. care about you. Oh, okay. okay bud. That is the person okay. that is trying to take our babies. Candy Laguna. Son of a bitch. Your Honor. Yeah. Senior Public Defender. All right. Mr. O'Leary, would you mind explaining to the gallery the basis of this lawsuit? Yes. Uh, <laughs> these two children, Paul and Saul Leesman, were offered for sale to Mr. Leesman. Sorry, to Mr. Spade here. Uh, after hearing that, he decided to seek custody of his friend's children. We've also further discovered that these children are gaining their mostly sole sustenance off of a dog's teat, which we do not find reasonable at all. We find what? that neglectful. Uh, uh, We're I'm... seeking custody oh, of yes, these children. That is, that is true. Two oh, for things made, <laughs> and these parents will still have the ability. All right, and new exhibit number one. This is a postal message from uh, Zane to, uh, who is this? It was a receipt from, I believe, from Zane, uh, to Zane from Dynasty 8 with regards to uh, buying a house. Uh, Zane is currently, uh, has been working to buy a large house uh, for himself, his partner, um, and the children. He is working to get an additional, I believe, $25,000. Beautiful that... home. A yard and everything. Mm -hmm. Big view. He's at 21 k at this moment. Um, and that's also supplemented uh, by defense uh uh, new evidence uh, two, um, which is a snapshot of his current bank statement, um, and uh, that also shows his steady uh, income. How, from how much money do you have? Promoted, a sergeant uh, on me right now. Yeah. All right. Any uh, uh, nothing. To give it all oh, to oh, you, oh, 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 Mister Laguna. No how much money do you have honor. in your bank? Let them go. Um, all right. Ten grand. Then okay, that's we move not bad. On. Any pretrial motions either party wishes to make? I currently have eighty-one cigarettes. Uh, not at this point in time, so no. No, Your Honor. We're fit to go. All right, then we move on to opening arguments. You got one prepared there, Kit? Yes. All right, you have the floor. I... <laughs> oh my God! I know we haven't talked lately, but that was rude. 
You cool? Yeah, Olivia, please don't punch the counselors. We cool? I know I know you're angry about Mr. O'Leary not being in proper courtroom attire, and I know you're tran channeling a little bit of Austin Kerr there, but, you know. I can take my shoulders out if you really want me to die. Do not, oh no, then I really well that. punch you. All right. You ready, Paul? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Your Honor, Clerk, that, and ladies and gentlemen of the court, today we stand here to hear a trial, not just about a prospective father, unfit parents, but about children in need of a new home, a need in need of a loving family, a need of a place to grow up. These children are currently uh, They starving, have that. They are not crawling starving. Crawling around looking for the next dog teat filled with milk. They have They don't six. have a place to sleep. A loving parent to hold them at night. Uh, that's me. That's what Zane is offering here. A new chance. A second opportunity to grow. With real nutrients. From a... Well, from himself. As he's been working on the ability to lactate. But also from formula with steady income, food Dina. as they grow, and Dina, yes, D yes, sorry, thank saying control outbursts here, and Dina. As we as we're moving forward here in this trial, you'll hear that not only has Zane been growing as an officer at the LSPD in rank, in opportunity, in financial steady income, but he has been dedicating his work to better this community and this city, to be a safe place for children to grow. The opposite of what Cliff Leesman has been doing, as he has been not available on his job. Objection! Becoming... Oh, good, good job, good job, Cliff. Becoming an inactive cop what? on duty. Objection! Lying to his You have to say what objection, what are you gonna say? Objection! Sir, this is an opening statement. There are Sorry. no objections. Sorry. Oh, it's it's all right. It's all right, sweetheart. Are we okay? Are we good? Am I good? <laughs> Don't watch. Don't watch. The passion continue. is good. The passion is good. All right. Lying to his wife about his whereabouts. What? And most Where have of you all, been? lying to his children. Their babies, they you don't know. You hear about a mother, Pauline, a pumper and dumper due to her alcohol abuse. <laughs> And not being there for her children while she seeks another Object. lover for Object. her arms. Object. What? Objection! Oh my god. Still, still oh opening. my god. Still opening. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh she, she, I, I'm sorry. The theme of it's today it's is, gosh. again, not about the, <laughs> the sadness of humanity. It's about the hope of a parent and a loving, and a loving family. And most of all, saving the children. Thank you. Thank you, kid. I just wanna... the kid. This is Marvin Gaye. Yeah, Marvin Gaye, save, save the kids. Save, save the, the children. children. If you're afraid, you can plug your ears, but this is about the kid. Uh, gotta save the children. Not, this not the, the children. Kid. My children. Our children. Not the children. Our children. Wait, Our, children. Right. Our children. Our children. I've got this. If you want to save the children, please okay. salute. Okay, okay. Please salute if you're on this. If you're in on this. Cross, cross our arms. No, oh, cross our arms. He got Save it. He got children. it. Cut. Candy hears it. Candy, Candy hears it. Don't mind. Don't let them salute. I'll win their hearts. Okay. All right. Enough of that. Thank you. You didn't even get to the part of the song where he says save yeah, the children. Yeah, well, it, it know, was supposed it, yeah. to, and it didn't it, fucking do it. Well, I'm I okay. Said it. You did it no, I'm fine. You. I'm I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm I'm already okay. We'll I'm get okay it again. We'll run it back. All right. Mr. Laguna, do you have an opening statement? I do, Your Honor. All right. Floor is yours. Not prepared. But from the heart. Today, courtroom, people of Santos, today, we don't just discuss children as if they are some sort of foreign concept we don't understand. We discuss their children. We discuss two twins that are loved, that are cherished. We discuss the beauty of heaven but also the danger of thievery. And the idea that the rich can't lead our children better than those who pay not with money, but with love. You see, on one side, people of the courtroom, I see 
two parents fighting the good fight. Tried to raise a child in the hardest timeline there's ever been, 1995. And on the other side, I see a man who needs to spend the majority of his day in a helmet because he's in fear of the world. A man who's <laughs> never raised children, never been tested by children, never been in a position that you need to raise the next generation. Over to my left, ladies and gentlemen of the courtroom, people of Los Santos, mothers, fathers, sons, daughters, and anything you aspire to be. We have a case of a thief trying to take what cannot be bought, what cannot be sold, what only we know in our hearts. I stand here not as a lawyer today, but as a representative of love, as a representative of commerce and the dangers the rich pose to those who cannot afford to stand against them. But that is why we have our amendments, ladies and gentlemen. That's why we have America, so that we can say no more to the rich and we can let the poor working man treat their child to some nice, fresh dog milk at their own back and call. So there is a theme of childhood today, people of the courtroom. And that theme is justice and love. Amen. Oh, Candy. <laughs> Beautiful. All right. Those were some wonderful opening arguments. Um, so before we move on to witness testimony, um, this oh, yes. entire thing oh, is yes. kind of an aberration. Normally, what would happen is child hell? protective. Well, okay. Look. Normally, what it's would happen in this circumstance is Zane Spade here would file a, a uh, complaint to Child Protective Services. Child Protective Services would then, you know, hop on over to the leaseman's house and then do an evaluation to see if the leasemans are fit to be parents. They but unfortunately, that in the, well, that's the thing. Just unfortunately, crash. in the state of San Andreas, we don't have Child Protective Services. So before that's we wrong. move to witnesses, I'm going to have to pull up uh, Mr... Mr. Spade and Miss Leesman, and I'm going to have to ask them kind of some basic demographic questions about kind of their living arrangements. That sounds good. Because normally this is information that would just be provided directly to the court from CPS, but we don't have that, and I kind of need that. So Zane, get up here. Go to do great, Polly. Can you do great? Don't panic, don't panic. Just, just, just remember. Fine. Okay, okay. Remember, the middle America's working class. Let me through, we, 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 However we raise our kid. Okay, okay. All right, so you want to do it like this? Okay, I'll stand over here, and then you stand over there. Oh, do you there. want me to sit on the other side? Yeah, okay. Wait, what? I don't no. know. No, look. Go go opposite of me. Where do you want me? Go opposite of me. Opposite go of you? Okay. Go he opposite doesn't of me. even know he's opposite. opposite. I'm opposite. Good. It's not, it, the, my, it, it. Good. Okay. So, Mr. Spade, please state your name for the record. My name is, uh, Zane Spade, man. All right. Have you taken any drugs or alcohol within 24 hours prior to this hearing? Oh, my God. No. Zane? <laughs> no, I haven't. What the hell? I mean, put the cigarette away. What the okay. <laughs> Put this cigarette away. Okay, okay. Mr. Spade, yes. are you currently married? No. Have you ever been married before? <sighs> I wish. Are you presently employed? Oh, yeah, man. Super. And what is your job? I'm a sar- I'm a- I'm a sergeant. Where do I work? The LSPD, man. All thanks to fucking Bonnie. The, the, LS, okay. the LSPD. Okay, how many hours a week on average do you work? I don't know what rank you are, though. Lots, oh shit! You know, like Andy, what rank is my husband? More, maybe. Uh, I'm just an officer. Lot, I think man. I have no idea. Okay. Okay. That's correct. But yeah. like, okay. not too much. Officer, officer. And how much do you make? He's not married. Oh man, I'm making like how much does a sergeant make, guys? Like fifty an hour. Fifty an hour. I don't know, like a good amount. We've been married so yeah, long. Forty-five. Yeah, that's so that's so fine. long. Oh, yeah, we, we get you and are you it's presently okay. looking for any new employment? Oh heavens, no. Uh, you know what? I do have a dream though of uh, opening up Zane's Zany Lemonades once I get enough, uh, you know, money to retire. Which you know, I just maybe soon, you know, help with the. It's, I I don't know. I just have a dream. You know? Okay, Cheers. Mr. Spade, what's your highest level of education? 
you know, uh, like high school, but sometimes like there was a couple friends I had in college in Berkeley and I'd sit in on their class and they would like write I'm notes to me and stuff, but I would just kind of like mm. pretend I was a student and see how long it took for them to take okay? me out. Like, mm-hmm. but like, Kiss the ass. You know, uh, and I also, okay, Mr. Space, I also have, have a part-time job with Rebel Radio, okay? Oh, yeah. Have you ever Rebel Radio, part-time job, okay. full-time job as an officer? Uh, I mean, I went to a uh, formal, but uh, then I, I have a degree, and I know, made, I lost some money. Register and no. were accepted to a college. That's all you need to know. But the okay. clothes were nice. Uh, we'll even say and they, everyone was dancing. The, the, babies, huh? the babies are about three months okay, old moving now. moving on. Do you have any vocational training? Three months old, okay. The two of them? Uh, I don't know if we have PTO. Twins. I don't really take a lot twins, of vacations. Twins. Twins. I don't know if we twins. Twins. Ball, 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 no, do, you have, do you have any job specific training? Oh training? yeah, oh yeah. I can, uh, you know, all the stuff that. Wait, a cop no, can no, do. scratch that. I'm talking about me actually. Whatever clip right. is. Do you have clip? any military service uh, I don't, record? I don't know. I haven't talked oh, to him in a week. Oh jeez. Okay, He's been um, working. I thought. Uh, I've got a license to kill legally. Um, okay. I'm a cop, uh, but I also uh, have a I license to sell. Don't. I have he a permit. I'm, I'm, I'm an officer. I'm a police officer. Just yeah, say that. that. Just say that. Cliff Cliff just mm-hmm. a, um, I have a license to sell lemonade sometimes when I sell it. You have a license to sell lemonade? I got a permit for it. Oh, okay. Mr. Spade, do you have health insurance? Yes. Who is your health insurance provider? Frederick. Police officers of America with inclusion of health insurance. Does your health insurance cover dependents? Oh, yeah. No, no. You have a family doctor. Uh, yeah, it's, um, it's, uh, uh, Francesca Rooney. Okay. Are there any particular medical facilities you visit when you're injured? Pillbox Medical. All right. Is Francesca Rooney specialized in pediatrics or pediatric care? I don't know if she's specialized, but she's real good. And she can uh, give me someone who is. Do any of the doctors at Pillbox, to your knowledge, specialize in pediatrics or pediatric care? I'm unknown because that's their job to tell me who to go to. My insurance right. is Mr. that good. Spade, we, they, where do you currently no, live? We, we don't do that. I currently live we over uh, down uh, we have like a family doctor coming from Ohio. Like a trailer. Oh, hi. Oh, God. Okay, so you live in a trailer, Ohio. is that correct? Yep. It's yeah, it's a geez. humble one. It's just because I'm saving oh, for this big, gigantic mungo house that I've almost oh, got. Geez. Okay, do you own that property or do you rent? <laughs> That's where I you rent. got your exit from. Okay, and how much is your rent? <laughs> I rent um, about uh, 300 a month. My family are Irish or something tonight. All right, and how large is your trailer? You have a very uh, large family. It's about, I can't keep track. You know, 500 square feet. 600. I sent right. you a Does Discord your message. have a separate room set aside for the children? Oh, yeah. Is that room furnished? Yep. Uh, Dina's been taking real good care of it. She's been practicing being home with stay at home mom. Wait, and, where's uh, Dina? You know, it, it, we don't even, they're barely going to be there because we're going to get that house any day now. Okay. And what furnishings do you have in that room? I've got a little crib that's handmade from a local lumberjack. It, uh, I've got, a, you know, the little spindly guys what? on uh, that on the top of it with spaceships. I've got uh, a couple balls that they can roll around and like, uh, you know, a, a, a dresser to put their tiny little baby footies in. All right. And when was your home built? Oh, gosh, I don't know, man. Not too long ago. OK, if you were to give an estimate. About how old is your home? Probably about 10 years, tops. Okay. Have there been any accidents within your home within the last 10 years? Oh, my God. The other day I went to go, uh, I was making some hot chocolate, and then I reached for a bag of, of uh, Doritos, and I, I hit the yes. I hit the, the mug, and I, and I, the hot chocolate yes. spilled yes. everywhere. Huh? What? Okay, so you spilled oh, hot nice. chocolate out of a mug. On and the it got on the carpet. It's all. F- uh, it was my bad. It wasn't a big one though. It just stained the rug a little bit. Uh, okay. So aside from this hot chocolate incident, have there been any other accidents in your home within the last ten years? Uh, sometimes I forget that there's a second step when I walk in. Uh, no accidents. Okay. No accidents. Like, you know that little step. It always gets you. You know. 
uh, and that's always. But no, like, nothing. How, how old? Three months old. Okay. Yeah. When was the last time yeah, your home you underwent maintenance? Uh, I I don't I I, I don't know. I, I don't really have to maintain it. It's just such a good trailer. So you've never once since you've lived there had to perform any maintenance on your home. And that is I've never had bullshit. to because I rent. The landlord mm -hmm. okay, comes okay. in and he's like, I gotta, I gotta crank that sink. And I'm like, all right, man. And I just kind of like sit back and I'm just, you know, watching. But I'm not taking okay, so it So your in. home has underwent job. maintenance then he because is the landlord has told you that he's oh, yeah, doing yeah, maintenance. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So what was the last time that your home underwent maintenance for and what was it? Probably like a year ago. Uh... I, I had some buddies over, man, and one of them came over and just really just fucking just really shit the shit the bed in the sense of the to of the toilet. He just clogged it up and had it's Mr. Gibbon, guys. And, guys, and, send him some love, please. I don't know what language he spoke, but I didn't understand it. So I had to try and pantomime my way into telling him that the toilet was clogged. And so a foreign okay. man came into your house and wrecked your toilet. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, no, no, a friend wrecked my toilet. Yeah. A foreign man came. <laughs> he, he's he's, let, he's letting strangers in his house. Sorry, allergy. We're good. Uh, I No, nothing crazy. So I was it the friend or was it a foreign man? That my friend shit a lot and clogged the toilet and I had to get a plumber. That's, that's that, you know. Okay, so who was the foreign man then? That's the plumber. The plumber was a foreign man. Oh, okay. Mr. Spade, do you have any pets in your home? Oh, no. Do you That's my little honey bunny, though. Do you intend on having any pets in your home? Uh, I don't know. We'll feel it out, man. I, I, I love me a good doggy. Okay. Are there any schools nearby where you live? Oh, yeah. Uh, Sandy Elementary. Uh, but at the same time, you know, when we move, we're going to be in distance to come down to the city and uh, leave. Uh, get up a good, nice private school in Vinewood. Okay, so you intend to enroll your children in private school, is that correct? If they want, if they see it, you know, it depends on how you, they they act socially, man. They wanted, they might just want to have a, a good public school, and that's all right too. All right. Are there any preschool programs in your area? Oh yeah. I, I need to know they're taking. Do you them intend to, to enroll your children in any of these programs? Yes. Yeah, you're an Irish, I think Irish it's good to get, you know, social okay. experience okay, I'm early fine on. With this. You know, they're going to hang out with yes. other kids and, uh, you know, learn other, whatever the hell kids do. Hopefully no bad habits. No, but it's not so even so, Mr. Given. There what it is. What preschool program are you intending on enrolling your children in? There's a lady called Miss Jameson down the street, and she runs it out of a little cottage, and she has a little preschool program that she does. I'm a big fan of small businesses as a, as a small businessman myself. Uh, great, great. You know, word on the grapevine. What the, she's, what she's the got hell? Great what the hell is Dina gonna do then if she is a stay-at-home mother? Do you know how many children are enrolled no in that idea. program? This is good. This uh, is good. Yeah, a decent amount. Uh, maybe like twenty. And how long has this woman run that program? Oh, I, she's been doing it for years. Probably oh, like twenty shit. years. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, oh, shit. Oh. Your Honor, we've knocked over a bottle of water. Um, <laughs> get someone to. Ah, um, oh, shit. Oh, shit. no worries. Hey, I got you. Uh, hey, don't worry. I got it. Uh, don't yeah, hey, no worries, so. guys. Oh, yeah, uh, objection, Your no Honor. We should I'm have the staff I'm who are intended for this position to do Mr. It. Spade, please Thank come you, back to Thank the podium. You, Sorry, wow. Thanks, it was just, yep. it just I couldn't help. It was in to so help. Wait, is that how Fuck. you normally respond to accidents? That might oh yeah, no worries, okay. guys. Hey, it's it's called an accident, not on purpose. Oh, thank you. All right, hey, thanks, I'm Sam. sorry. Sorry about that. Sorry for interrupt. I, I could potentially right. fake a heart attack if needed. So, Mr. Spade, I don't, I think when you go out case, with your it would show wife you are, or um, significant other, you know, who will you leave the children with? Oh, okay. Good idea. Oh, uh, I, I leave the, I leave uh, we'll the get, children we'll with the dog. We'll uh, probably order a babysitter. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes um, okay. Of course. If we, if we can do that. Um, you know, Kit here might be a great godfather. You know, we got a lot. Of, I got a lot of friends and family that just love children, man. And they'd oh be God. happy to hang out. You know, me and Dina, we don't go out. To, well, you know, Dina might uh, go out every once in a while, you know, man, but uh you know i i i'll let her you know do her thing go hang out with her with her gals you know and uh you know maybe kid can i don't know we got a lot of friends and family i'll hire a babysitter if i can't go yeah. okay have you ever personally met any of the babysitters in your local area no i would do babysitter interviews before i did any of that 
Okay. And how long have you known Mr. O'Leary? Oh, man. Feels like years. Right? Feels like a lifetime. Okay. To your knowledge, has Mr. O'Leary ever provided child care services before? Uh, to my knowledge, yeah. I think he's babysat a few times. He's got a cousin he used to babysit or something like that. All right. Okay, so that's all the preliminary questions I have from you. You may step down. Are you got this Thank you. Yes. Uh, all right, all right. I wonder if we can answer your question. Miss Leesman, your turn. Oh, God. Come on up to the podium. You got this, Pauline. Don't mm -hmm. worry oh, about oh, it. Okay. What a mother, everyone. What a mother. Hello. Hello, your, your justice. Hello, Miss Leesman. Oh, um, for you, Mrs. I have a handful Mrs. of... Mrs. I, I am happily right. married to my husband. All right. So for you, I have a couple of extra questions. Um, we'll start off with, uh, where were your children born? Well, they were born up in Sandy. Okay. And have your children been vaccinated? Uh, no, they have not been vaccinated. Okay. Uh, do your children have any allergies? No, I do not believe they have been back or they have any allergies. They are very healthy young baby boys. Okay. Have either of your children been diagnosed with any cognitive disorders? Nope, they are very smart, but one is smarter than the other. Have any of your children been diagnosed with any physical disabilities? N no, but one does have uh well, Paul is a little bit he does got a little bit of a growing issue. But the doctor said that is normal. And have either of your children been diagnosed with any emotional disorders? They they are three months old. They 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 cry. They are babies. All right. <laughs> I don't need to ask that question then. So, have you taken any drugs or alcohol within twenty four hours prior to this hearing? I smoke, but no. Other than that, no. All right. And are you currently married? Yes. All right. How long have you been married for? Uh, we have been married for a very long time. We've been together for a very long time. It feels like forever. Okay. If you had to give an estimate, how would how long would you say that you've been married for? Years and years. <laughs> okay, that's not an estimate. Longer than 30 years? Longer than 20 years? I would say about 10 years at this point. 10 years, okay. Have you ever been married before, prior to marrying no. Cliff Leesman? No. He is my first and only love. I love right. him dearly. Ah. I love you too, Chloe. I love you ah. so much. I love you so much. Ah. Okay. Have you, are you presently employed? Uh, no, I am not. I'm a stay-at-home mother for my two baby boys. Okay. Is Cliff employed? Yes, he is. He is All right, and what is his job? He is a fantastic police officer at the LSPD, and I am so proud of him. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Ah. Ah. All right. And how much on average does Mr. Leesman work at his job as a police officer? Um, hey, he works quite often. He is going off on special assignments, he tells me. But he does come home. I, I suffered from a case of, uh, I don't know the full term, but it is the kissing disease because he did come home and he kissed me and I was sick for about a month. So he had to come home and he cared for me and the two baby boys. Mononucleosis? That one. Okay. Do you know how much Cliff Leesman makes at his job? Hey, he makes enough to support me and our children. But you don't know specifically how much? I ain't too good with numbers and he does all the finances. All right. Um, are you presently looking for a new job? Uh, no, I'm happy supporting and staying at home with the two baby boys. I have been to offered your knowledge, work. Sorry, to your knowledge, has Cliff been looking for a new job? Uh, no, I believe he is very happy as a police officer. All right. Mrs. Leesman, what is your highest level of education? I have finished high school. Okay. Do you have any vocational training? Uh, no, I ain't a good singer. 
Do you have any military service record? No. Any professional licenses? No. To your knowledge, do you or Cliff have health insurance? Uh, do our no, no, but we do go to the doctor. Okay. Uh, and which doctor do you go to? Uh, the one at Pillbox, but we also have Cliff's family. He got a lot of family. They all live in Ohio. They got a doctor in his family, so they fly in. And they say, yeah, there's something wrong with you. Okay, so... And they as tell far us as what to do pills, to get, get better. So you have a family doctor in the literal sense that it is a doctor in your extended family, and then you also go to Pillbox, is that correct? Yes. Okay. Uh, Mrs. Leesman, where do you live? We live up in Sandy. But we had okay. some issues with the, the fumigation. So do you live in an apartment, a house, or a trailer? We, we lived in an apartment. We had to move to the motels. All right. Do you own that property or do you rent it? We are renting it. And how much is your rent? Uh, again, it is my, my husband. He does all the numbers. They get all jumbled up in my head like spaghetti. Okay. And how large is your apartment? It is enough for myself and my two baby boys and the dog and my husband. Do you have a separate room set aside for your children? Uh, yes. And is that room furnished? It got two cribs. So, other than the two cribs, do you have any other furnishings in oh, that I room? Mean, we got we got the storage. We got the the dresser that also is like a changing table. Aww. It got little okay. cute ducks on it, like the cute little Aww. rubber ducks. And some of them got the little bows on their heads. I love those little bows. Those little, I know you picked them out. They were so cute. Yeah, I sure Aww. did. Uh, so well that you remember. Yeah. Who is that? But that is uh, my so husband. And then I have painted on the walls. We got permission. I am. I, numbers get squiggled up, but I am a fairly decent artist. So I have painted murals on the walls. Okay. I made sure the paint was childproof. So if the children decide to lick the walls, they ain't gonna get ill. So you made to use uh, paint that does not have lead in it. Is that correct? Yes. That ain't going to get sick if they lick the walls. Because I did paint some lollipops. All right. <laughs> uh, to your knowledge, do you know when that apartment was built? Uh, no. It was built before we moved into it, though. All righty. Have there been any accidents in your apartment within the last 10 years? Um... Within the last 10 years, yes, we did have an accident. I got pregnant. Ah. But that was the happiest accident of our lives. Okay, so that is to say that you did not intend to become pregnant at that time? Uh, but, no, but it was the happiest accident of, of both mine and, and Cliff's it sure, lives. It sure was. Yep. Beautiful. Beautiful. Ah. All and right. we, so and was I was last... so good at being a mother. I I didn't have just one baby. I got two. Oh, you got blessed by two baby boys. <laughs> two baby boys. Ah. I didn't okay, even so... know. <laughs> hey, I'm asking questions here. I'm sorry. I just get emotional Your when job, I think about my children. My job children. is to answer. My job is to ask questions. Your job is to answer okay, questions. Okay, I'm sorry. So, so please sorry, answer the questions just... as they are presented. Okay. When was the last time your home underwent maintenance? Mm. It's been a few months. Okay. And what was that maintenance for? I think the the, the shower, it kept dripping. So okay. Cliff, Cliff went and fixed it. He is a real handy man. Alrighty. Do you have any pets in your home? Y yes. Yes, we have the dog. Okay. Other than the dog, do you have any other pets? No. And what type of dog is it? It is. It is a a, a bigger a bigger dog. It is a, a. I don't think it got a breed. If that's the right term, it got. Well, it got a breed. It got a bunch of breeds. Okay. Uh, is your dog professionally trained? Uh, yeah, well, I mean, by professionally trained, I have trained it. Okay. Are you a professional dog trainer? 
Uh, no, but I have trained it very well. And I think it is a professional. Okay. <laughs> have you ever had any problems in the past with your dog? Never. And has your dog ever been around children before? Uh, it has been around my children their entire lives. Uh, okay. So at your uh, motel room, are there any schools nearby? Honestly, sir, I have uh, not gotten that far to look for schools. Uh, okay. That is a discussion you I need to have with my, my husband because the bebes are only three months old and this is a developing city. Okay. Uh, are you aware of any preschool programs nearby? Uh, I'm not intending to put my babies into preschool as I am a stay-at-home mother. Alrighty then. So when you and Cliff go out together, who do you leave with your children? Either if one of uh, Cliff's, one of many extended families is coming in, they stay. Otherwise, it is the dog. Okay, <laughs> and how long have you known um, one of Cliff's many extended family members like um, are you in regular contact with yes. these people or my, my entire life oh all right do you know if any of these people have uh prior experience with providing child care services yes all right and uh of the extended family that does provide child care services uh how long have they been doing that um, they all have children they, they, their children have children. They, they, some of them are teachers. Some of them are doctors. They, I, honestly, I get mixed up because there is so, so many of them. Okay. So you did say that when no one is available, you leave your children with the dog, correct? Th this is correct, yes. Okay. So how often do you leave the children with the dog versus leaving them with one of Cliff's family members? It is only when one of Cliff's family members that is not available. And I'd leave the children with the dog. Right, but uh, proportionally. Like, how often do you end up leaving the children with the dog versus with one of the family members? Oh, well, he is a professional dog. It's not a he either. It is a she. Okay, ma'am, that's not my question. <laughs> how often, proportionally, do you leave your children with the dog versus one of Cliff's family members? Well, the dog is always there. Not <laughs> long. Correct. And it is so it's how not, not, often, very, not very often your justice not very often okay yes. all right you may step down <laughs> all right now we move to the actual witness testimony uh, oh, Kit, do you have any witnesses you wish to call uh, i mean where's the bathroom where, where, where the bathroom is wait, wait. the other way Oh, it's back the Pauline, other way. Pauline, Pauline, yes. Pauline. Yes. They know. They know. I... They know. I, I gotta go. I gotta go. They know. What, what do you mean they know? I have. What do you, What do you mean that you they know? You got half the police. You, you got half the police. You know where the bathroom is? Where is the bathroom? That's yeah. Uh, right. Listen, you got half the police for shit. Shouldn't I'm they know what your husband my, looks I'm like? I'm going to lose yeah. my babies. Listen, you've just admitted in court that you leave your dad, your dad with fucking six they, nipples they to look after your goddamn kids. Pauline, you got this. You're doing great. But I know that. I... All right. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to lose my babies. Listen, Polly, you head back to the courthouse. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna pull him together. He's gonna be the perfect <laughs> husband. Don't worry. What do you mean? You're gonna be, you're gonna be fine. You're gonna what do you mean, Polly? I believe in you. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to lose my babies, and I'm, and they don't, this I shit. don't. Listen. Oh God, Amen. Uh, everything, everything is gonna be, everything is gonna be fine. Everything is gonna be fine. Amen. Since when the fuck were you a daddy? <laughs> uh, it's a lot of stories. Do you mean Cliff? Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't Cliff. know, I don't know what you're Cliff. talking about. Oh my God. No, no, no idea who this person is. It's okay, Paul. <laughs> Please just let let, let me know my Dara. May, oh, yeah, may, maybe I'm mistaken. Yeah. I just wanted, I, uh, you looked a lot like my friend Eamon Murphy, no. and I wanted to tell him how much I miss him, and how cool of a guy he is, and I had a tragic accident that I thought he should fucking know about. That's, and I'm bored now, but it's not a problem. You're not Eamon Murphy, no, so I'm, fuck Cliff, you. Keep in the corner and do it. Keep in the corner and do it. 
It's okay. It's okay. Look concerned. Look concerned. Shh, shh, shh. It's okay, Polly. It's fine. <laughs> You're good. It's okay. You need to. Don't, you... don't mean over that. You look like you're being sick. Yeah, no. You're, 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 you need to. You need to be strong, Polly. You're new. You need to be strong. It's going to be fine. It's going to be okay. Don't look like you're being sick. Don't look like you're being sick. I don't know how to look like I ain't being sick. I'm crying. Don't go near the trash. Don't go near the. It's down over here. You said you'd go by the trash. Yeah, you might look above the trash. Yeah, I got it wrong. I got it wrong. Oh, Jesus. Kidding me. Okay. Stand on the. Stand on the side near the trash. It's. Why are you out of the pictures? Block the, block the bin. Oh. Now it looks like he's thrown up again. It's, it's, it's okay. It's okay, Polly. Listen, I'm just. What I'll do is, I'm gonna go to the store. I'm gonna get you some milk. Okay, remember, remember no, how no, milk no, really calms no, you down. The, the dog I'm gonna get you some milk. The milk and got no, six no, no, no. cakes. We're gonna no. get you a six pack of beers. Calm down. Okay, you need to be looking like you're concerned, Cliff. Okay, right yes, now you look like you're causing the tears. Oh, Come it's, on, it's, it's a, like it's a bear bear Yeah. I'm gonna lose my babies. Hear that clip? She's going to lose your children. <laughs> now, scene. It's gonna be fine. Relax. Relax. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm gonna lose. Relax. We're gonna lose our babies. No, we're not. No, you talk to me. Talk to me, Polly. Talk me. Oh, God. I'm sorry. Did they get it? Good, good. Nice. What if we put Paulie in a wheelchair? There, see? Everything, everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be just fine. It's gonna, it's gonna be crap. It's gonna be crap. It's gonna be all right. Just relax. It's okay. Fantastic. Okay. All right, get back to the court right. before we get back. Right, yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay, remember, we can't go in. You gotta do this by yourself. They know. They know too much. You're gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> I can't do this by myself. No way. How was it? Yeah, maybe. I, yeah. I, 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 would, I would be happy maybe. to fall over dead right now. Boys. Like, I made it. Actually, it's finally happening. Cliff. Cliff. Cliff, no! <laughs> Put your foot up! Drive! 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 Don't leave me! I just... Get in the truck! Get in the truck! I can't leave my babies! I love you, Polly, but we gotta go! Cliff, please! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Oh no. What babies are you gonna lose? That's what that was. Is that what this court case is about? I heard it was about some kind of adoption ship. <laughs> Will you be my husband, please? What? <laughs> please, will you be my husband? Will I be your <laughs> husband? Who are you? My name is Pauline Leesman. Why are you crying? Because Pauline? I'm gonna lose my baby boys. I don't know where my husband is. This other man was my husband and now he's gone. Pauline! Is this him? No, this is my lawyer. What's going on, Mr. Lawyer? She's he, having he's a moment. <laughs> What, what happened, Paul? Cliff left. Cliff left? Yes. Fuck! <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck! How am I supposed to be leave. your husband? I'm asking this man to be my husband. At least this one's a cop. Are you, are you, how am I supposed to be your husband if you already have a husband? Shit, shit, shit. <laughs> Shit, 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 shit. I, I really hope you're not asking me to pretend to be your husband in court. No, no, she's not. No, why would no, she do I that? I would never do that. What were you thinking?
Fall in. Come on. Let's get inside. Okay. It's okay. This is okay. It's like, don't worry, officer. Don't worry. Come on. Fall in. Let's go. Pauline, I I'm here to help you. No. No. <laughs> fine. Cliff. What do you mean, fine, Cliff? He, he got away. Please find my husband. Sometimes he goes by the name of Eamon Murphy. He drove off in a pink tornado. He was your husband? Yes. I know him. Can you please find him? And what? Have him come back? Yes. I will give him can, all I of my cigarettes. My There's hey, 80 of them. Someone's trying to steal her children in court. My two baby boys. Right. How long is the recess? Negative Over. two we, minutes. We have to get back there. Yeah. Okay, I'll go see if I can find him. Right. It might be a PDM. That's where I found him the first time. Okay. I got another idea where he might be. Alright, <laughs> let's go. Come on. Alright. Don't worry. We got this. Just, just hustle, 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 hustle.